Hello. Today, I would like to talk to you Today, I'd like to talk to you about smoke. It's been smoky here lately in the Pacific Northwest. Very smoky in Salem. Getting better today. Oh, sorry. Thought I might be tackled or shot or something for talking about smoke. Oh, wait, no. I mean, the duopoly. The Democratic Republicans are going to come after me. Okay, <laughs> I just pretend. I'm actually hoping they will at some point because I'm so bored. You're old boys, Matt. Second nail, must the hello win? Yep. No, I'm not really bored. That's not even the right word. Um, I just think there's got to be something. Yeah, something better. This sucks. Hello. It doesn't suck. It's fun. I like this. Anyway, disappeared. Disappeared. Today, I would like to talk to you about, well, lately I've been thinking about trees. So again, subvert the duopoly, since they do tend to work together, right? They punch each other with one fist while shaking hands with the other. Withhold your vote. And if you do, tell people why. That's so important. Tell people you're withholding your vote to subvert the duopoly. We need to make this change. We need to get away from this ping-ponging of the Democratic Republicans, right? No matter which part of that you think you are connected to. If you withhold your vote, tell people why and try to organize with other people to do the same or consider any of the other political parties that we have in the u.s green party psl right party of socialism and liberation uh, gloria lariva howie hawkins angela walker uh leonard peltier just and make a point of it though don't just secretly vote for some person Tell people why. If you withhold your vote especially, if you don't vote, tell people exactly why. We need to send a strong message to the Democratic Republican Party, right? To the duopoly, whether you're a registered Democrat or a Republican. And I don't know, like I said, I'm not a part of the Republican Party in the U.S., so I don't know. They might actually be doing a better job than the Democrats. They might be doing a better job at this point. And uh, that's weird and twisted. So, if you want to do something about it, you can't just keep giving Biden or whoever the Democrat is your vote blindly. Please, open your eyes, right? Look around. Consider other people and let people know why you're doing what you're doing. Organize. Punch each other with one fist, shake hands with the other. They usually shake hands behind the scenes because they want to keep that duopoly power. That's what we need to, to subvert and break up. We can do that by withholding the vote. Don't give them your vote just because you're, oh, you're more afraid of the other guy. I get it. People are afraid of Trump, probably should be. But every single time the Democrats have some level of fear, right? Fear mongering, where it's constantly, oh, you can't, you gotta, you can't do something different or better now because of the Republican. Ooh, camera on camera.
GoPro 3, GoPro 8. Hey. Still working after like 200 years. GoPro 3, 200 years old. Yeah. All right, thank you. Oh, again, I gotta fall over because it's funny. So I'm gonna fall over right here. All right, slapstick. Oh, sorry, that's all I got right now.